Taylor definitely depends on her mom quite a bit. I am still trying to get her off of my car insurance and our cell phone plan. She's 23 and she's getting married and she's still on our cell phone plan. I can't get her off, she just stays on. Your lack of preparation is not gonna cause a crisis on our part for the rest of the family. Well, maybe not you, but I'm about to have to gather up my friends on Facebook and tell them to come over and help me. You don't have any friends. Mom. <laughs> if you had friends, Taylor, I wouldn't be here doing this. Most of my friends I actually met online, and I've never met them in person. Those are my friends. Get off I'm your just phone. proving to you that I have friends. Okay, people who are on Facebook are not your friends. So get off your phone. I was young when I had Taylor. I take full responsibility for Taylor's dependence on me. But I feel like it's time to kind of cut the cord and let her do a lot of those things on her own. So what do you think? Is it everything you wanted it to be? No. The window's not what I wanted. It's crooked, there's bubbles. You have to fix it. I don't have time to redo this, and this is the first thing that everybody sees when they walk in. It's not that big of a deal. Yes, it is a big deal. I don't think anybody's really going to look at it. They have to. If they don't, you need to direct them to the sign and make them look at it and make them use my hashtag and make them go to my photo booth. If they don't, then everything is ruined because there will be no documentation online of it. I expect my wedding to go viral, and that's going to make me a celebrity, basically. If it's not exactly how I want it, I don't even want to have this wedding because I'd rather there be no documentation, no photos, no nothing. We might as well just march our way down to the courthouse and be done.